Well, a safety alert tonight. The city of Mobile is moving one of its busiest precincts to better serve the community. NBC 15's Rachel Wilkerson joins us now. Rachel, officials say this move to DIP is a big deal. Andrea, it's a very big deal. This building will give the officers more space for training, and it can also be a place that citizens can hold community meetings. Not only that, it's close to the interstate. This rendering shows what Mobile's new first precinct will soon look like. And many times, many, you know, citizens down here on Dolphin on a Parkway really just thought they had been forgotten about. City officials today spoke about how nearby residents felt their community was going unnoticed. Chief Roy Hodge says as soon as MPD officers move from the old building on Virginia Street into this much larger building, citizens will see a large increase in police presence. You'll see police coming and going from this location up and down Dolphin Island Parkway on a daily basis numerous times a day. Bobby Holly lives in the DIP area. He says having first precinct here has been much needed for years and he feels safer. Quicker response time. I love it right here. It's, uh, they was talking about it the whole time. I'm glad they put it here. Data up until May of this year shows Precinct 1 officers have responded to roughly 870 calls. Precinct 1 is, is one of the busiest precincts here in the city of Mobile. Uh, one of the reasons is because it's such a large, vast area. Not only does this building provide a better response time, a magistrate will be on site, rooms will be open to the community for meetings, MPD will have training here, and will be able to cut down recruitment classes from six months apart to three. We will be able to have three academy classes a year, which is a really, really significant change in the number of policemen that we have the opportunity to put in the street uh, every year. So that's a huge uh, part of the why are we doing this. And I think the people of uh, DIP, North and South, can be proud of what they have. As far as the current first precinct building, Mobile's traffic unit will move into it. Reporting live in Mobile, Rachel Wilkerson, NBC 15 News.